Hey there guys, welcome back to another video to Alpha Main Toby where today we're going to be doing Android Studio Tutorial 2. So, yesterday I showed you how to do Android Studio, how to, what is Android Studio and today I'm going to show you the user guide to Android Studio. So meet the Android Studio now today. So this is based on the IntelliJ idea, I'll take you this link in the description below. Oh my goodness. Uh, wait, 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 okay. Uh, so the user guide is really really cool it's really easy to know a flexible grail based system is there a fast rich emulator a unified environment where you can develop all you all for your, all your android devices for all of your android devices like watch tv android tv android watch mobile phones tablets so many things are there uh, this supports C++ and NDK and if you are a person who loves programming this is the best software where you can start get started to create apps and games actually the apps and games in this world is really really growing fast you see so many apps coming up in Google Play Store it's really fast so I promise you guys that this will be something which you will try to look up at okay so let's get straight into the project structure project structure okay each project of Android Studio contains one or more modules which have source files etc. So you're creating an application. It has so many files. It has a Java file and manifest, uh, the resolution, the Gradle scripts etc. etc. It has so many things guys. And coming to what we will be learning in the future, this is it. This is one, two, three. This is all of your console. This is all of the thing which you'll be going to doing. See, this is made on. You can even download this on the Mac, Linux, and Windows version. So, first one is the toolbar. So, let me show you where the toolbar is. It's just up here. This is our toolbar. We have the files: save, machine, refresh, undo, go forward, cut, etc. So many things. It is just like a PowerPoint where you can do. But when you go, when you scroll over that, it'll be shown what it is about to say second one is the navigation bar which helps you to navigate the project so this is the navigation bar where you haven't been in your my application you open the file my app source main code java and you are in the main activity java where you write down whatever files you store actually an app is where so many files come together to work out so you know you'll be going through this this is an editor window in the third one and fourth is the tools window so what is the editor window here this is the editor where you can edit out all of your commands to which you give to this and the fourth one is the tools window this is the tools window where you'll be showing files some debugging console and you'll also have an emulator and the five is the to-do the stator bars the status bar, uh, the status bar, displays uh, all of your project status projects and other warnings, etc. So everything is there, guys. It's really, really easy. You also have uh, those. What do you say? Easy shift commands where you can uh, do everything. See command one, command plus two, etc., etc. It's really easy. And code completion, basic completion, guys. Actually when I come to the know the code it is a really easy emulator if you write down you can know what you're gonna do I'll show you in a second in a second there's so many this you should go and look out to the user guide it's really easy now let's get straight into this blah 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 always when you open this you'll get this so ignore these if you want or else you'll just show you so this is how your emulator will look I hope you can see my arrow there is my arrow okay it's flickering so this is how your emulator will look and this is your main activity java don't get don't get tense this is nothing this is the most easiest thing and the next activity where i'll be opening is oh wait i've done this wrong so you see guys you should never be so what do you say oh no I don't know this oh no I don't know this you will be learning everything is as easy as boom there you go it's easy so don't worry about that so don't ever think uh, that I'm not gonna do this you will be doing this so guys you follow my videos you be there with me and uh, I've seen so many people who have subscribed to me 16 subscribers that is really great from your side 
I hope you could give me more subscribers so more people could learn this. And okay, let's go to main activity jail. Wait a second. App. Um, build. Okay, no, an app. What is there in my app? Manifest. See there you go we are here what does this do see everything has everywhere so when you write android allow backup it is true so everything starts with android as you have been using android you see now before the manifest an application you write you can write anything you want like etc android you see now if i put android see android value it'll come up showing me what what type of command you want and it'll be easy for you to learn how do you do this like that so my application is here my main activity is here so there's so many tutorials coming up for this Android uh, Studio so you could go down and look out what you're gonna do this you have so much time doing this guys I promise you so see this is the text and I'm here so that was the design and this is the text you will you see small small changes that will be having coming up here see the Android layer with rapid content so this will be wrapped around the whole screen you won't see smudges etc like that Android text is equal to hello world. So now let's change this text to H I A L L. Hi all. This is an app. So yeah, there you go, guys. See, uh, this is processed into this, and you can even put the text layout. You can even put the how much size the text should be etc etc you can wrap the content while wrapping content etc etc you'll be learning this while you come up uh, so many while you come up in the coming in the coming videos because um, it'll be a little big big scope where you'll be learning this so don't worry about this guys this is really easy rather than compared to any other thing so everything starts with Android here because uh, guys this is based on Android so whenever you give a command you give the command for android to commit the command for you yes so don't worry about uh, whatever you think that no i have to write simple it's so simple like android layout width is equal to match parent the parent is this the where you get the black uh, about this is all the parent that is all android for you the application is not an android for you so see guys hi this is an app and C yes Android padding at bottom so if I click here it'll be shown C you have clicked this now if I click my application here excuse me okay oh sorry <laughs> I just clicked it twice okay my application this no need of running problems you can even edit here you can you know you just uh, can do everything here it's written my application search for where it is written my application I think I can't see that mm. technology AMT wrap content hi all this is a web app yes it's somewhere you have to uh, you have to this is how you start off this is not how you start off I'll show you how to start in a new project how to start the new project so this is your gradle this is your console everything will be so easy I'll show you how to start in a new way so when you open new you go to the new project now here when you start off new it'll open like this guys I'll show you in a second the project will load like this so now you can put it like Android tutorial like that so I have put up amdtechnology.com your company domain and your application name everything is there guys this is how you start off so the project's location you can choose where your project should be located in your laptop 
that is stored in an ABK so when you put up in the developer console it will be easy for you to find out so next phone and tablet where where is where you watch watch where means watches and TV means TV Android Auto uh, Android Auto and Glass now Google Glass has been coming out so you know that Glass is also there mm, Android, Android Auto means everything all and TV is Android TV where is Android watches phones and tablets are the thing you have to do you could choose any of these for targeting Android devices I preferably I'd say that they consume a lot of time doing it you could do the next way next time when you do next so you get to add an activity to, to the mobile you're going to do you it's an it is it is it an ad for yourself or is it the navigation or master or detail flow login maps and I'll show you next tabbed activity settings activity and etc where you can literally go to any activity you want we would always start with off uh, to the b basic empty activity because you don't want to fuss up much so there you go the next so you can put your activity name I'll put the activity name as main activity only you can put the activity name as anything else like you know my activity one my activity two etc etc activity name is not set to a valid big class uh, blah 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 don't worry about that guys my activity my ac activity my activity in it's enough finish and your project will be starting create starting to be created so don't worry about this and guys until it gets started I'll be showing you guys that you have been supporting me so much I was in zero and you brought me to 16 subscribers like that uh, thank you guys for supporting me so much but there are no comments from your side I'm really really sad for all of that you guys are not been commenting me see 19 subscribers I saw 16 and now it's 19 subscribers it's really good for you guys to keep on subscribing I'll be doing more of these Android Studio intros. Let's see if we have started off. We are building our Gradle. Until then, we'll see this. So when you come back to this place, you can see that you can uh, make more phones. You don't want Nexus 4. You want to have a new nice phone for this. You can put up. Okay, <laughs> mine is loaded. Mine is loaded. Okay, I'll show you guys. You don't want Nexus 4 you want Nexus 6 and Nexus 8 it has been there see you have Nexus 5X, Nexus 6P etc etc Android Wear, Round Chin, TV um, Glass etc so where this is an emulator for you guys look at this now Nexus 9 how will this look on Nexus 9 this is how Nexus 9 looks but you see the phone the phone the tab sorry not the phone the tab looks like this in the Nexus 9 Nexus 5X, how does this look? This looks also good, isn't it? Yeah. So Nexus 5X looks like this. You have so many skins for your phones which you can know like the height, the weight, the height, the size of the width of the screen where your app will be running. So let's get uh, let's close this project now. Close it. Yes, and let's get straight to this project search everywhere double shift project view alt 1 go to file recent files navigation bar drop files from the explorer okay thank you so let's start a new project okay open a file blah 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 excuse me gradle configuration is going on right now so don't worry guys you don't know what a gradle is gradle is a place where what you do to what you command, you commit your command in the console, and uh, emulator here will actually put in the commands itself. It'll turn transform your commands into its commands, and will give out the solution. So this is known as the Gradle. It'll be executing tasks like debugging and running the code of yours and transforming code into like if it's the code for uh, Android. TV, it'll be con it'll be changing the code into the Android Android Wear, that is the Android Watch. So you don't have to worry about how it'll look, how it'll be coding in this place, but it, you have to consider about how it'll look in everywhere. So let's start. 
डबल शिफ्ट ओके ऑल्ट वन ऑल्ट वन एंड ड्रॉप फाइल्स हियर फ्रॉम द एक्सप्लोर ओपन अप एवरीथिंग गाइस सो यू नो सी दिस ग्रेडल हियर एंड्रॉइड मॉडल माय एंड्रॉइड मॉडल लुक्स लाइक दिस एंड टू डू एंड्रॉइड मॉनिटर bell variants etc etc you have your emulator etc so this is how your android this will look i'll be showing you this i'll be showing you how to edit this all in in the next video or some place because guys you know i have a gap of doing this and that for you guys you guys have been subscribing to me that the best thing you can ever do please put down a comment and put please put down a like too so that i can know that you have been liking this video or even try to dislike i won't say anything cuz you know you're not doing this good and comment down why you dislike my videos so to become a maniac just subscribe to my channel <laughs> and uh, okay guys i'll see you in the next video until then stay tuned and download this and uh, goodbye